In today's story, I will take you through a completely unscripted journey where players will roleplay as if they're living in the medieval ages. Players must band together, forming their own kingdoms and prepare for any war that may rise against them. They must be smart when it comes to who they elect as their leaders, as it could mean the difference between the rise or fall of their kingdom. The last kingdom standing will be declared the winner of this challenge. Hey, I'm Josh MV. Subscribe before I hit 1 million subscribers if you want to be a part of the OG club and allow me to take you to the very start of this adventure where our story begins. All right, fellow knights, it is time for our new adventure to begin. Huzzah! 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 Here we go! Woo! Ladies, let's go! All right, boys, let's go! Chop some trees, my fellow knights. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got the wood. Yeah, you got all the wood. <laughs> we need to stick together if we're gonna be a strong knighthood. Oh, there's a wolf attack. Really? Leave me, you furry beast. Die. All right, is it two person boats or is it solo? Yeah, it's two person boats. Okay. I released the IP to the rest of the public, and we began sailing westward. I wasn't sure where this adventure was going to take us, but I had a deep feeling this would be a journey of a lifetime. Oh, it's 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 the end of this river. Everyone, at the end, let's dock out and head up into the forest. Don't leave your boats here for our enemies. Yes, yeah, Oh, bye, bye. we already have a death on the server slain by a fair wolf. We gotta watch out for these furry beasts. We need to protect B. All right, she's our princess. Yeah. We were in search of a place to build our kingdom, but food was our first priority. Let's go kill some animals. We began slaying the beasts of the land and then started exploring a nearby cave. Oh, you found a spawner? Yeah. That means you can loot it. Oh, zombie, attack. Finding a zombie spawner in a challenge like this would surely oh, benefit out, us. And so I picked oh, it up I and began it. traveling to a nearby hey, 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 forest. Hey, hey. This forest would be the location of our future kingdom, as we officially declared ourselves the Forest Kingdom. While we began clearing trees and setting up farms and, of course, building a mine shaft. Josh's shafty mine is going to be right over here. Hey, yo, what you meant by that first time? Hey, yo, chill, buddy. What? Many other nations were starting to take form, which is why it was very important we got set up as quickly as possible. Possible. Anyone could attack us at any time, and so we needed to be prepared. I got a goose. I'm gonna name him Chicken. Goose the Chicken, welcome to your new cage. Gosh, that's a terrible name. Hey, chicken how dare ye insult me, brethren, you I bloody dead bag. I know it me. was you, you trifling <laughs> scumbag. Josh? Yes? We need resources. Resources? Can you gather a group for me? Ah, sure. No problem. Thank you. I'll be back shortly. All right, gents, who wants to come with me on a mining expedition? Oh, I do, sir. Me. Uh, Gear up and let's go in my old shafty mine. That's, that's a cringy name, but let's go. Would you like to be beheaded? Maybe. Then take go. thy insult back, <laughs> you golden turd. Gold, from this moment on, your name is golden turd. <laughs> <laughs> we began our mining expedition. It was important we stay together. That way we have a much better chance of surviving with such little gear. Although I'd be lying if I said there wasn't just a small part of me that wished the Golden King got blown up by a creeper. I'm joking, Gold. Chill. Anyways, I'd say this expedition was a great success. We found a diamond and a crystal cave filled with tons of emeralds and gold blocks. We mined for a while longer, then headed back up to our camp. Honestly, it was really fun being at a camp with a bunch of friends. It felt really lively. Oh yeah, I got 50 Two iron, a diamond, five emeralds, 24 gold, 45 lapis. I'm stacked. Oh my gosh. Yeah? Jurian helmet. <gasps> you did it. Oh, let's go. I got my first knight helmet. Thank you, Power You're Core. Thank you. Yeah. Yo, who's right behind us? It's the emotional nut. It's just Matt. Yeah. Matt, yeah. how'd you get in our cave? I've, I've been here for like... 20 minutes. What? Kill him. I was good if I could kill him. Why were you, why were you looking at us like that? Kill him. Um, I think it's the only way, Josh. Oh my God. Hold on, Gold. Calm down. Why to kill me? I haven't done anything. Oh, there's the emotional nut. 49. Oh, yeah. No, that guy was also I here. I don't know where he came We from. can't let that guy steal our stuff. God, I was lost for forever. Hey, welcome back, good sir. I see you brought a pig. I stole a pig. For some reason, I feel a strange connection to this pig. Me too. <laughs> that was an inside joke. Only people who saw our last war video would understand it. If you missed it, don't don't worry, you can watch it right after this one. After working on crafting some armor and sleeping bags, Ace, come here. I got something for you. Yeah, from here, buddy. Sleeping bag. That way we can no, cuddle can up sleep. next to each other. Whoa, what? My mic just. Oh, you are nothing. A member from an enemy kingdom asked to speak with me, curious to see what he had to say, and hoping it wasn't a trap. I agreed to talk. 
Okay, well, what would you want to say, Miko? Um, nice to meet you, by the way. Nice to meet you too, Josh. Our diplomatic leader of- Yeah, Mikuo was a part of the Magic Tribe and was sent to request a meeting with his leader to discuss a potential okay. peace treaty. So who's who's your leader? Do I need to go to them? We would have to set up a meeting place, but if I could like just get a small note of where your guys' base is that we have it for future reference, just so that our diplomatic team can come. I'll tell you what, in a day's notice, I want you to come back with a book and a diamond. And in that book, I want there to be cords to where you want me to meet, preferably at your base, you know, since since you know where we are. Requesting a diamond this early on would prove they really wanted this treaty to happen. And it made me feel a lot better that it would be less likely a trap. All right, the plane is set. I'm going to step back off to my base. All right, nice talking to you. Thank you very much. While Mikuo went on his way to bring his leader the news, the Golden King approached me saying this. Guys, we have a problem. What's up, Gold? Uh, so yeah, downstream, yeah. me and Bugaboo found out there's a whole number of civilization though. Oh no. Who is it? Is it is it is it plains or mountain or I don't know who they are. I think they're plains. They're most of them it looked like they were Viking, but they they spawned me. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, me, that's not make... good. An enemy kingdom nearby would most likely only cause problems. Golden, come here. Kneel before me. I am claiming head of the night team by Honey's permission, of course. <laughs> of course. Thanks, thanks, honey. And as so, I now knight thee as assistant of the night forest leaders. And I would like to I would like to give you this legionary armor helmet as a symbol of your power. Wow, thanks, Josh. Well, fancy. Now, don't listen to my orders or pull any treason against us, and it won't just be off with your helmet. Oh, Let's God, just put no. it that way. Well, I'm honored. And I will make sure that I will help you lead our army to victory. All right. I'm trusting you, Golden. I trust in you as well to be a good leader. Now, as assistant to the leader of the night forest, yeah. I want you to choose two other gentlemen tonight and also right. work on crafting us legionary armor. I'll definitely come back on you with my decision. After knighting gold creeper. and a creeper exploded our farm, I gave the princess some newly crafted armor. Honey, yes? I need you to be protected. So wear this. We can't have you dying out here. Wear what? Oh. Madam. Oh, hell, honey. Three chants for the queen. <laughs> huzzah, 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 huzzah. Although we still had a long ways until our kingdom was secure, we were making good progress. But I'm thinking of making you general. The Golden King decided to bring on a player, Bionic Creeper, into the knighthood, assuming he helped teach the princess magic. Meanwhile, I began clearing out an area to set up a base camp. I built us each our own tents, and while player Jess underscore Matt, who I had just underscore met not that long ago, uh, seemed very suspicious. That's tent. You got a friend in Mia. Just remember that, Josh. You've got a friend in me. And Mia. Hey, yo, oh wait, did I? Oh wait. <laughs> Who's Mia? You friend know, you? you know, Matt. You're so kind, man. I hope, I hope we, we are friends for a long time. So you guys aren't gonna kill me. I mean, no. I why would to. we do that? I mean, Not unless you give us a reason, you know. Yeah, I was only acting. I wanted him to think that I trusted him, but really, I wouldn't trust this guy with a carrot on a stick. Let him cook. Anyways, I began setting up a chest tower out of wood. Which, uh, now that I'm thinking about it, is probably a mistake. Meanwhile, the magic tribe finally came back for the meeting we had agreed upon days ago. Now, was it suspicious that it took them so long? Yeah, it was. But let's hear what they have to say. All right, let's uh, let's chat right here. And we'll listen to what you have to say. Yep, as you requested, one diamond. Thank you, sir. And a book and quill with our meeting house cords. Well, thank you very much. It took you longer than I had wished, but uh, it's here nonetheless. We were having some troubles with somebody killing me and taking the materials that we had to go with a scouting party and take them back. May, may I may I have a guess who? Yep, sure. Uh, is it a group called the Magic Tribe? No, we are the Magic Tribe. I was oh, hey guys. wrong the first time. Apparently, there is another uh, mountain tribe that I don't even know where they were, but we are the Magic Tribe, yeah. And then Raven is our leader, but he he has been off somewhere. Hmm, somewhere, huh? Okay. Yeah, we, we're trying to get him back to base, but he's like, I'm still on a mission. And we don't know what his mission is. Okay, cool. Uh, so when would you like me to meet at these specified chords? And well, um, here would be our meeting if it's all right with you. Right here? Oh, so, so these are the chords to your base? Yep. Ah. Okay, nice, nice. I mean, we're meeting right now. Yeah, does that work for you? Yeah, yeah, we'll go on, go on. You know what? It works for me, too. Yeah, it works for me. We are here to negotiate a peace treaty between our two tribes. Seeing as we have a kind of rogue mercenary tribe, I feel like it could be very beneficial. Hmm. Okay, as an offering of peace, we'll send you off with some food. But to seal the deal, I want you to bring me back 
two horses. In exchange, we'll give you either sheep or pigs. Allow us just a moment to discuss. Okay, take your time. Take your time. While Mikuo discussed the details of the treaty, an enemy player approached nearby. State your purpose. What, what are do you doing want? Here? Uh, I was going back to my base. This towards right. our base. My base is over there. All right, go on then. Okay. We won't kill you this time. We'll let you go. After deciding to let the player continue on with his travels, Mikuo agreed to bring us two horses to complete the treaty. We will accept your deal. It might take us a while because we can't find any horses at the moment, but we know where the planes are. Okay. So we will have a scouting mission. All right, follow us. We'll get you guys fed up and you can be on your way. And just as we were heading back to offer Mikuo and his friends some food, we had our first of many interactions with Galaxy. Cheese. Hold on, guys. Oh, Galaxy yeah, Cheese? Know. What's Galaxy Cheese doing he here? Said he came to warn us about a tribe. I want to yeah, warn you, man. Uh, I made a treaty uh, with them and they murdered me. Galaxy is our enemy at the current moment. That's, That's because. Right, hey, 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 don't be hitting. Whoa, whoa. Guys, 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 calm down. Calm down. Everyone, calm down. Calm down. Maya, what did I just say? Player Galaxy go. Cheese was now declared an enemy of the Forest Kingdom. Yes. Hold on, everyone, quiet. Galaxy Cheese is now our declared enemy because we're nice. creating a treaty with the Magic Tribe. Miko, Shark Buddy, the Master, and whoever else is in the Magic Tribe, all right? You're all gonna treat them with respect and make sure you feed them well. And if they ask anything, you help them out, okay? But of yep. course, we have to complete our treaty with them. They need to bring us back two horses. For now, boys... Let's get you some food. After stacking one too many sheep on top of each other and crashing the server, Mikuo and his tribesmen set out in search of the two horses required to complete our peace treaty. While I began to transport our furnaces and chests into the tower I made, I want you all to meet just Jolty, a player who would later on become the most dangerous and troublesome outlaw on the server. I mean, just look how he ruthlessly roasted this poor kid's mic quality. Your mic is even worse than before. It's like, it's like incredibly bad. I didn't even know a mic could sound this bad. This is when an enemy Hello? player approached you, uh, our base. Night walking. I just wanted a screenshot of you. A screenshot? I was wondering if I could get a photo. With oh. Sure. Cheese. Okay, yeah, I, I did not expect that. The kid just wanted a screenshot with me. Do you have some fun in this event? I am, and uh, I really appreciate you. Of course, bro, of course. No worries. Thank you. Thanks for joining. Well, right, that was nice. You know, if you want to play along with me in these events, all you have to do is click the Discord link in the description and make sure to keep the announcement notifications on so you don't miss out. Anyways, the next day, the Master 45 Master, from the Magic Kingdom the approached our base with the two horses we had asked for. Master, you come with the horses, I see. Yeah, my, my team is right now are offline so um i thought you guys were a little worried about them so i kind of just gave them i appreciate the offering my fellow friend yeah no problem hey. the treaty was now commenced we'll see where this leads us later in the story but with the combined powers of both the forest and magic kingdom things are not looking good for any enemies that might arise speaking of enemies they were advancing their bases at a surprising rate but at this point we had pretty much no idea where the other kingdoms were located and so ace gaming and i decided to mount our horses and do some scouting. I'm not exactly sure where anyone is, but here goes nothing. Yes. Onward and outward. Oh, I think there's people over here. Looks like it. Oh man, look at all that sugar cane. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> no one's here. Hmm. See someone across the river there. What is this mysterious machine? Huh. The first base we found seemed abandoned, but we did notice some strange machinery. I wonder what this does. Some sort of magic. I don't know. All right, well, no one's here, so I guess let's keep going. Yeah, come to me, Pegasus. Okay, side note. Ace had such a slow horse. It was brutal. Yours is slow. Yeah, mine is extremely slow. You have the fast and the high jump horse. <laughs> <laughs> what have you been feeding that thing? Horse meat. Josh, I don't think you should feed it that. We traversed mountains and traveled through various biomes only to find nothing. What's this? The remnants of an old base? Formerly the home of Galaxy Cheese. I know that name. That's the enemy of our alliance. Well, at least we know he deserved it, right? Oh, yes, most definitely. It's becoming nightfall. We better hurry. Wait, Ace. I've forgotten. I have a book with cords in it of someone's base. Oh, yeah. Oh, watch out. I remembered I was giving a book with the Magic Kingdom's coordinates in it. And so we began heading in that direction. But first, I tamed this cute wolf. It's a dog. Do you have any bones? No, I don't. Oh, I, I got five. That skeleton when I had a chance. Come here, boy. Yeah, I got On him. The first bone. First bone. <laughs> oh. Oh, he saved me. Thank you, boy. Oh, man. What a great dog. Hey, wait a minute. Something about this dog doesn't seem right. Yep, yep. Just as I thought, this is not a male dog. This is a female. Uh, are you sure? Let me check. Oh, yep. You're right. Well, in that case, I'll name it 
Samantha. After taming Samantha, we finally made our way close right to the here. Mountain Kingdom's oh, base. Oh, 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 and so we tied off our horses and began sneaking up a nearby mountain to gain some high ground. I see him. Looks like there's at least five. Get back, get back. They might see us. Man, they already have a whole wall system set up. And you're building houses. This is not good. This must be the mountain tribe. Makes sense. Oh, someone's right below us. Yeah, so we thought this was the Mountain Kingdom's base location. Wish it wasn't. It was the Magic Kingdom's base. Yeah. Unfortunately yeah. and yeah. ignorantly, we decided to try and covertly steal some resources. Now, with proximity chat and all, we just had to be really quiet. So that way the players at the base didn't hear us. Yes. Big man's coming. I got wizard. Dick. Pass. Dick. I got wizard pass. Yeah, sure. How do you get out? You can have them. That's just a sorcery house. We were so close to the players, we could hear them. Meaning Ace and I couldn't really talk to each other. The first house we got to didn't have much loot, and so we decided to dig over to one nearby. Um, uh, so, well, I guess, uh, anyone- We were in! We started stealing everything we could that we thought might be valuable. And just as we were about to leave, we heard this. I am back. I am back. Look back. That was a close one. Anyways, I couldn't resist some arson, and uh, so. We were stupid enough to let ourselves get spotted, and this mistake would cost us big time. Ace, he's right behind you. Keep running, keep running. <laughs> Run, Ace. Lead him away from the horses. Away from the horses. He's not following me anymore. No, they are. They are. There's four of them. There's four of them. Right here. Right here. I had managed to dig a hole and shift, but sadly, Ace couldn't find me, and they caught up to him. I couldn't just leave him behind, and so I hopped out and tried to help him fight. No, what's up? Ah! Gosh! I killed him! No! I'm no! Here. Get over here! No! Let this court gesture tell you a little something. It jump scared me, by the way. <laughs> Stop here! Josh, come back here, we was allies. They got me! Dude, I literally ender pearl the worst ender pearl ever. I could not believe it. Look at this ender pearl. How is that even possible? I mean, we should have never gotten caught in the first place. And there we were, both dead with all of our items gone. And that wasn't the only problem. Now the kingdom we were supposed to have a treaty with, knew we just committed theft and arson against them. Ace, what do we do? What do we do? I don't know. I don't know. Wait, um, honey? Yes? Uh, would you mind coming with us real quick? Let's just say I had a plan to get our items back, and our princess honeybee was a big part of that plan. You guys, you guys stay here, keep working on the wall, we'll, we'll be back. We made our way back to the Magic Kingdom in hopes to trade for our oh, items hello. back. We, we come in peace, we come in peace, we promise. Aren't you the guys who burnt down that, that wizard home? No, no. Burnt down a no. wizard No, no, I was told to guard this place, I am not. No, it's like, okay, we, we come bringing a gift, we come bringing a gift in exchange for peace. Hey, don't get close. Okay. Can you call your leaders over? You guys, here? guys, we, we come in peace. We, we, we're bringing a gift. Hey, man. Listen. Long time no see. Listen. Hey, I am so sorry about what just happened, okay? I didn't know this was your guys' base. I didn't realize we had a truce with you. Okay, we haven't actually met you guys yet, but now we, we realized our mistake, and we want to make it right, okay? You guys, by chance, still have our items, right? Uh, yeah. We got some, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Um... I'm sorry, honey, I don't know how to say this. but uh, <laughs> so what? so we were thinking in exchange for items back, we'll give you our princess as a prisoner of war. Oh, uh, what? Whoa, oh, we need to have a meeting. I'm oh, so sorry, honey. Hold, 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 hold on, hold guys on. Guys, we need a meeting. We need a meeting. Come here, come here, come here. Hey, give us a couple seconds, man. Listen, honey, trust me. I, we're gonna we're gonna come back and save you. This is just to get our items back. Come here, Josh. <laughs> Josh, follow the British guy. Josh, okay, you go. I'll All right, stay big with All right, Josh, stay come with here. Her. Yeah. Josh, come here. Come here, Josh. So guys, what, what, what are you are thinking? Are. What are you thinking here? Alright, it might be a bet because she is a she is fine. Oh enough. my dude, I may I may be a fool, don't, but don't worry, that's a human person over there. Yeah? Like mm, what do you guys think? 
I say, I say yeah, I say yeah. Stuff. Hey, she's good with magic. She's good at gardening. Just wait, wait, saying. Any funny business? Uh, I'm coming for you, okay? Yeah. Oh, bro, yeah, your breath yeah, stinks. Yeah, remember what happened Hold last on. time, Josh? Okay, okay, okay. I won't listen. Listen. Can we have our items, please? Yeah, please. Yeah, we'll, we'll bring out your stuff. We'll bring out your stuff. Okay, yeah, cool. Stuff. Guys, guys, we got a deal. We got a deal. Yeah. Oh, I guess that's not. Honey, I'm sorry. Trust me. We'll come back for you, okay? Here's your stuff, Josh. Yo! Oh, great, Wait, great. Uh, oh, A's! You had nothing. You had nothing. <laughs> Definitely didn't have that much things. Okay, this is my stuff right Jesus here. Jesus Christ, how much okay. more stuff is in this? Okay, just about everything here. Oh, my backpack's gone, though. Do you, you guys don't have my backpack? Sorry, I ate it. It's all right. I got most of my stuff back. It's fine. Yeah, we want the princess now. Well, guys, it was nice doing biz with you, honey. I'm sorry, but uh, it had to be done for the kingdom. Josh, don't do this. No way. I'm sorry. It. I'm sorry. It has to be done. Well, Ace, what do you say we, we get out of here? Yeah, yeah, no choice. See you guys. Best of luck with your kingdom. Treaty's alive. Well, the trade was successful. You're probably thinking, why in the world would I trade our princess just to get some of our items back? Well, hey, you'll see, all right? I had a plan. While Ace and I made our way back to get our horses, an NPC approached us. Hey, Josh, can I, uh, uh, I want to give you something. Sure, what is it? Well, I dabble in the arcane arts, and I found this nice, and I found proof of a teleportation pearl. Oh. Oh, really? Sure. Keep it safe. It'll keep you out of a tough situation. And no, I am on your side. Thank you. I appreciate that, man. I uh, don't have the best of luck with these, but uh, hopefully maybe Hi. now I can do a bit better with them. Okay. I have to go back to my kingdom now. All right. Let's go get our horses, Ace. Yeah. Oh, they're right here. We found our horses and began the journey back to our base. And it was a long journey because Ace and I got lost on the way back. Ace, I'm afraid we're lost. Oh my god. Whoa, we found some random people. Hello, random people. Um. Hello. Hello. What are you guys up to? Not much. We're exploring. Ah, okay. I guess we'll leave you to your travels then. Nice meeting you. You too. Don't do anything foolish. Eventually, though, we found our base, and I gathered everyone around to make them aware of the situation that just unfolded. All right, everyone. We have some news. Ace decided it would be a good idea to trade Bugaboo for our items to the Mountain Tribe. Wait, Is what? Ace? 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 Ace, you suck. Listen, listen, Ace. don't go too hard on them. Hey, 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 listen. I think it was necessary. I doubt that, man. But listen, there's an upside to this. We now have an insider in the mountain base, and that's B. And not only that, but we have our items back. We're not going to leave B in there forever, right? Don't get any ideas. We're going to go back for her as soon as we can, but we need to get stronger. The enemy forces are, are getting way out of control. They're, they're progressing way too fast. So, brethren... Group together, grind together, and let's win best kingdom of the Middle Ages! Yes! Huzzah, brother. No, no, you can't win anything. <laughs> I'm told to get golden. This was all just the beginning of the chaos that was about to unfold. And little did I know, poor Honeybee was being tortured by Trito the court jester. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Um, just for fun, honestly. This is fun to you? Yes, very fun. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Josh, he's stupid. You know, trading you on a gem like you, uh, we're gonna have so much fun together. <laughs> you have a very warped sense of humor. Oh, I know, honey. <laughs> You're just gonna be in here for a little while longer. <laughs> That was surprisingly terrifying, but keep in mind, I had no idea any of this was even happening. Speaking of not knowing what's going on, remember earlier when I mentioned player Jez Jolty would be causing some serious problems on the server? Well, the River Kingdom left their base unwatched, and unfortunately for them, Jez Jolty took this perfect opportunity to raid their base and set everything on fire. The River Kingdom's players arrived back at their base moments too late. Everything's burning! Stop the fire! Stop the fire! Put it out with your hands or something! Put it out! Put it out! Put it out! While we're burning to the ground. 
gosh dang it. Player Galaxy Cheese was the leader of the River Tribe, and since he was our sworn enemy due to our treaty with the Magic Tribe, I didn't feel too bad about this happening. But I wouldn't even find out about this raid until later on, when a couple members from the River Kingdom decided to head to our base with an attempt to get on our good side by offering us some drinks. Oh, what's this? Never had this before. Let me try this. Definitely never had this before. Oh, does it feel good? Oh, whoa, it's taking me to a land of euphoria and magic. Wow, what is going on? Yo, these sheep are looking thick. I'd like to have a second one just to make sure it tastes good. Oh, anyways, it was clear at this point we needed to really develop our kingdom and turn it into an actual kingdom and not just some dainty campsite. And so we began Operation Your Mum's a Gardening Tool. The details of this operation include using the Schematica mod to ease the expansion of our kingdom. I worked on a castle, Ace worked on a cathedral, the Golden King worked on a tower, and Not Something Blue and Mystic worked on expanding our walls. The walls would be a massive project, taking thousands of resources and in honor of not something blue and mystics hard work we gave them the diamond raking a raking only true patriots receive after finishing the me. castle and relocating our horses i decided to build a secret underground chest and furnace room to make it a lot more difficult for our enemies to raid All our right, loot so and it seemed to be correct, working i pressed this button wait a second and it's open. How? I'm trying to figure that. Okay, wait. <laughs> and it works. It confuses people which button it is because Matt can't even figure it out. Josh, you've actually confused me, dude. Congratulations. <laughs> you actually made a secret base. Secret base. Yeah. Yee all right, so that's our chest and furnace room from now on. Okay, while I was making the secret tunnel, apparently Ace Gaming sprawled up a giant meeting hall. Th there was just one problem. What the? Oh, yeah. That just keeps popping up. I don't... Who built that? How did they build that so fast? Who did this? I, I, I think it was... I think this. This big... Did you do this? Uh, I know who did it. I know who's doing it. It's Ace, right? Ace. Yeah, Ace. <laughs> of course it's Ace. Bro, of course Ace builds a freaking mansion. <laughs> I did no such thing. Ace, <laughs> why did you freaking build a mansion? This isn't a mansion. I this is this the meeting hall. Did you say this is the meeting hall? Yeah. Bro, what do you think I made you build over there? That's at a church. <laughs> okay, Come Ace, here, Ace. Ace, Ace. Come Ace, here. Ace, Ace, Ace. This is literally the meeting hall. <laughs> Oh, Josh, we got a new house. Be happy. Oh, <laughs> my gosh, bro. Well, thank you for the house, Ace. I, I appreciate that. Speaking of houses, he King plays. plays, a oh, random no, wait, player who me. somehow joined our kingdom, built the world's craziest house behind the cathedral. Like, check this out. Oh, my gosh. It's <laughs> literally no it's literally a dirt house made of stone. He's in a hobbit hole. I got pics of Josh in it. <laughs> I, I'm still trying to figure out when he got a picture of me. <laughs> Our kingdom was looking absolutely amazing. It was finally starting to look like an actual kingdom. And well, I was starting to feel like a king. Hello, and so hello, when a couple hello. players from the Magic Tribe wanted to speak to me in the cathedral, I exercised my power. First bow down. Yes, yes. There you go. Okay, now you can all talk. Right, right. So, <laughs> hi, I am one of the founders of the Magic Tribe. We come on terms about our alliance. Mountain has your queen, correct? To your knowledge? Correct. We yeah. have your queen. We think you guys thought we were Mountain, but we were Magic who allied with you. So, in fact, your allies have your queen. Mountain's somewhere completely different. Like no, no, no. We're, we're aware of that. Yeah, Raven was a bit confused. Well, really confused. <laughs> but he mentioned he could help us battle the Mountain Tribe. Tribe, like the actual mountain tribe and so i wrote this message for him to deliver to his fellow leaders who can i trust to give this this book to of the magic tribe i believe me okay so i have given you a book that states in five days time meet us here and prepare for war because we're going to combine our powers to attack our enemies i feel like this is a reasonable thing yeah. so bring that bring that back to the rest of your tribe your leaders talk it over with them all right see you guys See you soon. After a couple of days of preparation, I gathered my fellow members of the Forest Kingdom and made them aware of what was about to go down. Listen up. It's time to go engage in battle with our enemies. We'll be calling over the Magic Tribe soon for backup and to utilize our alliance. Next Moonfall, I want you all geared up and ready for battle. Golden King? Yes. You're in charge of the knighthood. Make sure they're prepared. I will do my best, sir. Ace. 
You're in charge of the assassins. Perfect, sir. All right, guys. I'm going to bring in the magic tribe, and we're going to begin planning for battle. Now that everyone in my kingdom was caught up to speed, I brought the magic tribe in to let them know what was going on. Have a seat. Have a seat. Have a seat. So many of you. Together, we will be quite strong. All right. Leaders of the magic tribe, step forward. All right. Stand in front of me and bow. Magic tribe, two heads are stronger than one. Together, we will be victorious in battle. Who is your head leader? May I? Yes. Pronounce your name. My name is Raven, sir. Raven, do you swear loyalty and responsibility for your tribe during this next war? I swear absolute loyalty for my tribe. If anyone betrays us, your head is on the table. Yes, sir. All right. Gold, Ace, you have anything to say? Yes, I would like to bring up a incident earlier. Okay, I'll give you the, I'll give you the floor. So if many of you do not know that we were actually surprise attacked by the mountain tribe and for some reason they chose my base and sadly they have killed one of my dogs. This dog, it, it got me through a, a lot and because of that I'm going to make sure Josh will lead us into, sorry, that Josh will lead us into a great victory and make sure that my dog's name is not in vain. Thank you. Yes, Gold, of course. So, because of this, our first enemy and tribe that we're going to attack next is the Mountain Tribe. The Golden King's heart was truly broken over his pet dogs, and so this battle would represent revenge for our fellow knighthood commander. We prepared our gear for battle as much as we could within a day's time, and met in the cathedral for one last battle speech everyone look around these are your teammates your tribe members your allies study their names study their faces because when we go into war things might get confusing we began our journey to the mountain kingdom with our combined powers i felt as if the mountain kingdom didn't stand a chance however when it comes to war it always comes at a price and this battle would definitely cost us Onwards, brethren! Assassins with me! No. Together we are strong! United, we will be victorious! Down here, down here! Who is it? Where, where, where? Are they here? We managed to kill a couple of mountain players, but as we raided their kingdom, something felt off. There should have been a lot more players here, especially since they somehow knew we were coming. Why did they not group together and bunker down to protect their base? Then I saw this message. Wait, they're at our base! No! No! We forgot about that! We forgot about that! I couldn't believe it. My heart sank. Apparently, they had sent a group to raid our base while we attacked theirs. We ran as fast as we could back to our base in hopes to stop them from doing too much damage. Ace? Where's our base? Josh, you don't want to see it. You don't want no. to see it, Josh. No! <laughs> no! Show me! You can kind of see the damage from here just looking through the trees. Oh, no. oh it's still on fire. Oh, oh my gosh, gosh, bro. Josh, our house. Ace, yes, it was so beautiful. No! All that work just gone in a matter of seconds. Hey, and it was all my fault. I felt terrible. But then something suspicious happened. We don't even know who it is, do we? We do. It was Omeo and uh, Blazing Pig. Dude, I found Omeo on the way back. Wait, 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 wait. Raven, I found Omeo on the way back and you told him who someone said he was with us. Okay, let me explain. Let me explain. So Shark is uh, the other person who created my tribe. He has recruited like multiple people who have done horrendous things and stuff. I understand you guys are loyal to the scouts, but he is not a good leader for you, man. Right? No, no, no. That doesn't answer my question. Why did you say Omeo's with us when he was? Because just I burnt. saw him at our base, um, and I thought Omeo was he's lying one of the on people you you Yeah, when we were heading back from the Mountain Kingdom, I had spotted Omeo in the forest, and just as I was about to attack him, Raven from the Magic Kingdom, who we were treated with, said this. Wait, wait who's this? Wait, that's not oh, what it was. Oh, wait, no, oh. he's with us, he's with us, he's with us. Oh, he's with us. Either Raven was a traitor and helped plan this attack, which would honestly make a lot of sense, or he was really just telling the truth and got confused. The problem was we had no way of proving anything and our treaty with the magic kingdom would be at risk if we did anything to raven yeah we were in a difficult situation and our base was in shambles i called for another meeting in the cathedral to debrief and plan our next move I, I quiet got, down I quiet still, down <laughs> thank you ace thank you jesus all right i feel like i I feel like ultimately this is my fault. I should have had some people stay back and it, it completely slipped my mind. 
but we may have been defeated in this battle, but we'll come back even stronger. I've come up with a plan. Three people are gonna stay back and rebuild while the rest of us go hunting for Omeo and whoever else might be a part of this. Who wants to stay back and build? My head builder, I will give him to you. The rest of us, let's go hunting. And so while a team began rebuilding our base, we set out to find Omeo and those who helped destroy our base. Apparently they're running. Oh no, they're still on there, they're still on there. Top, right side, right side, right side. Run guys, run. Yeah, they might, they're gonna make a run. Oh, we spotted them and the chase began. I have an ender pro. Yeah, yeah we'll give it. Um, wait, 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 if I can get up, wait, someone with you see him, Josh? No, I see blue. I probed the blue, gosh dang it. I swear I saw a name tag over here. They're still chasing him. Um, Raven's still chasing him, but weird. It's each person fan out and go in a direction. After chasing him for a while, they had somehow managed to get away. And once again, we were left empty-handed and hopeless. That right was right until right we right spotted Omeo once again near our base. Tell Omeo to, to stop or we'll kill him. Omeo. Hey, Omeo uh, yeah. We're, we're taking you hostage. Don't move. Do not move. Can I interrogate? We're, we're gonna bring him back to our base. All right, start walking towards our base. Get him, get him, get him. Come on, Omeo. We had finally caught Omeo, the player who had caused us so much grief. We brought him back into the cathedral's jail cell to interrogate him. I was hoping to find out if Raven was a traitor. Drop all your Drop items. items. Right now. You gold, gold, calm down. Gold, gold, calm down. Listen to me. Listen gold, to me. gold. Calm down. It's not worth it. Okay, we need info. We need info. He killed. Both go, of my dogs. Go, one of them go, being a more warrior go, to my one real Calm one. down, calm down. First of all, Omeo, we want to know if you set our base on fire. <gasps> uh, 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 Omeo, you have one chance to answer this correctly or I slay you right here. We right have now. info. No, we just want to see. No, no, Gold, stand back, stand oh. back. We need more info. We need more info, Gold. Listen, buddy. We need yeah. more answer info. Question, you get, we'll let you have your justice later. Now we need to question him. I did light your base on fire, but my base said you uh, guys were attacking it. How did you have info we were leaving? Uh, my friends told me. Who's your friends? I was already at, the, was already at your base. I was here earlier, and I had flint steel. Hold on, Omeo. I need to talk to Josh. Um, you go. Okay. I think we might have a traitor. The odds seemed heavily in favor that there was a traitor amongst us. Master Bonnie then says that they have Master some info Bonnie that proves his statement so wrong. But what upon questioning say? him, we got nothing. All right, Omeo. Last question. Why did you kill Golden's dog? Uh, um, <laughs> it's funny. I mean, you killed all my friends. You killed all my friends, so I. But that? I got revenge the only way I could. Ace, bring Ace in. Gold, Go ahead, Ace. stand back for a second. Wait, is that a boy or a girl? He's getting out, he's escaping! Let me kill him! And I'm trapped in here now! Omeo escaped! The whole kingdom began chasing after him! He's glitched! What's going on? He's What's going on? Yeah, get him. Him. Wait, What's going me? on? Oh, he's trying to get out! Don't let him get me! Oh. Josh, just give me the word! Freeze Josh, him, freeze just... him, freeze him! Freeze him, freeze him! Hey, hey, hey! Nope. Move me! Let him die! Not yet! Wait, where's the smoke hey, Somebody hear the traitor! No, he's running, he's running, he's running. This way, this way, this way, this way. Our base is being burned down. I'm already back in it. Got him. Build, 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 build. Build him in a box. Higher, higher, higher. He's stuck, he's stuck. Let Josh interrogate him. Let Josh interrogate him. Omeo, stop trying to run, bro. Or else you're just going to make things worse for you, okay? Yeah. No. Listen, come, I gotta go. come back to the prison with us. We're going to just say a few more things. And then we might let you go, depending on how it goes, okay? Can I ask okay, 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 something okay. right here? Walk back. Omeo. What is it? Do you know Pugs? Hey! Okay, that is the dumbest escape plan. Gotta go. Let's see you. Was that Reagan that did that? Reagan. Yeah. I Are you him. betraying us? Pause. None of this makes any sense. First, they know the perfect time to attack our base. Then someone opens the door long enough for Omeo to escape. Then someone throws smoke bombs and he escapes again. And finally, now someone helps dig him out. Oh, but at this point, I had a good idea who the traitor was. Someone who had been there the whole time. Someone who seemed harmless, but in reality had intentions of betrayal. Finally, I caught him in the act. I saw his username. Gotta go, let's see you. Was that Reagan that did that? Reagan, yeah. Hey, Are I you betraying him. us? No. Blue, I'm freezing him. Yeah, he is. It was, it was, it was Reagan, no, it was Reagan. Don't let him, it's Reagan, it's Reagan. Raging trying to escape. Someone else is tunneling. That was you. Yeah, get raging. Get raging. He raging. died. Now it was time to let the Golden yeah. King finally get to say what he wanted to Omeo's face without interruption. Gold, say your final words. So, Make sure you keep freezing him. 
You know Angel, the dog that you killed one of my dogs? Uh, I thought it was Hunter. It was both of you. I watched. Oh. I watched. That was memorial to my childhood dog. You killed him. You made me cry. And for that, <laughs> I'm gonna make watching. sure you got the slowest death ever. Do it! Let's do, do this. it! Do it! Kill him right now. Finally. Good riddance. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you got your revenge. That was my dog, man. The Golden King finally had his revenge. Order was restored into our kingdom. We brought back O'Meal's grave into the cathedral where the Golden King gave a victor's speech. Today, I have gotten revenge on the man who killed my dogs. One of them being relatively new to me and the other being old as time. This just proves to what Josh just said that our traitors and enemies We'll get their heads cut off, and we're gonna keep them as trophies every single time. And this just also just proves that we are powerful. We will make sure that no one will get away with their life who hurts us, and we are gonna make sure that the Mountain Tribe won't die for burning down everything that we worked for. Huzzah! Yes! Yes! We will get revenge, Gold. We will get revenge. And by the way, you're probably wondering why Galaxy Cheese has freely been around our base. Well, after his base was burnt down, apparently he made peace with the Magic Tribe, meaning we no longer had a reason to recognize him as an enemy of our kingdom. Do you know who burned my home? Galaxy Gouda was still searching for answers as to who burnt down his base. In fact, at this point, none of us knew who it was. Of course, me and you know it was just Jolty because of the replay footage from earlier, but just Jolty was still out there, getting even stronger than before, and he was about to cause us a lot more problems. People approaching base! People approaching base! I'll, I'll deal with them. Bring them in the jail. Josh, Josh, just a jolly killed me. As we were attempting to jail a fellow arsonist, some of my members spotted just Jolty and his teammate approaching our base. And so we began chasing them. But then for some reason, all my teammates got sidetracked with something and I didn't just want to let them get away. And so I continued the chase by myself until eventually I got close enough to approach them. Die! Wait, I won't kill you if you talk to me. Okay, uh, uh, hey. Ow, that kinda hurt. You're part of Mountain Base, right? Yeah. yeah Your team burnt our entire base down. I mean, that's one person, not 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 all of us. That was me. Hey, that hey, was man. him! Yeah. It, it, it was just only was, I, I burned uh, like both places. How did you guys know we were attacking you? I mean, because some of us uh, were at the base and some of- Wait, a Galaxy told me. Are you serious? No. You're lying. Okay, I am. I am serious. Like he So apparently Jolty helped Omeo burn our base down. And now he's saying Galaxy Provolone betrayed us. Are you are you just lying to to cause trouble or are you serious? I'm serious. Like zero something told Galaxy and Galaxy told me. But the way he said it, I, I just didn't know what to believe anymore. I didn't know where to go from here or what to do. But then Bugs accidentally spawns a zombie with his wand. And so I took this chance to attack. Run, run, don't look back. Let me live! Well, I was being chased by three players and one being the most skilled PvP player I had ever witnessed. And they were catching up. This is the worst terrain to run in. Let me live! No. Well, that's it. He got me. Our base was raided. I lost all my items. I now had virtually no will to go on. Depression oh had been sneaking God. up on me, and before I noticed, it was already too late. I was now consumed by it. A black cloud of hopelessness. I, I was too far gone. The apathetic words Nothing murmured repeatedly through my head, over and over again. And until I only saw one way to make it, make it all go away. I'm done! I felt like I had failed everyone, and unfortunately I was letting the negative thoughts win. I, I decided to remove myself as leader and banish myself from the kingdom. I found a cave and decided from now on I was going to live a minimalist life of solidarity. miss everyone but the longer time went on 
the more I regretted this decision. Uh, sure, I had a lot less problems to worry about, but being alone made life feel even more worthless. I, I had no one to build farms with, no one to go mining with, no one to laugh with, no one to make memories with. I had realized just how self-consumed I had become, and, and that was the reason I wanted to end things and just isolate. It was all due to a deeper issue of not focusing more attention on those around me and, and being grateful for what I did have instead of focusing on what I didn't. And now, more than ever, I wished I had never given up. I missed my people. We Over here, I think we found them. Josh, please come back with us. We'll get your items back and everything. No. We also have an insider to get the princess out. Really? Yeah. The princess? Yep. Oh, man. Yep. Okay, in that, in that case, fine. Because I feel terrible for what I did trading her for my items. And now I don't even have my items. Listen, guys. If you can help me get my stuff back and help me get stronger, we'll go save the princess. Deep down, I was so happy they found me. I now had a chance to right my wrongs. And while I was gone, they had managed to rebuild our base. Finally, I could see the light at the end of the tunnel. It was a new day, a fresh start. And instead of dwelling on the past and the things I couldn't change, I, I began to focus my attention on what I could. And in doing so, I felt something I... Hadn't felt in so long. Hope. All right, guys, the magic base. Hello, sir. Do you put the ketchup on the shawarma? Some of you put ketchup on shawarma. What is that? No. We began the journey to the magic kingdom to save the princess. Since we had a treaty with them, though, it was crucial we made sure not to leave any trace behind that it was us who saved her. Luckily for us, Think Waffles had an insider who would help us with her escape. All right, guys, my insider should meet us here any second. All right. I'm trusting you, Waffles. Better be right about this. Uh, I've never done anything bad before. Oh, Raven's right there. Oh, hello. This is my inside. Oh, hey, guys, guys, I know where Honey is. Honey? A princess? Yeah. Okay, okay. Shift. Right. Everyone shift. Everyone shift. Just follow me, guys, okay? All right. Okay. We slowly made our way towards the wall and began digging below their base, assuming it would be the safest way to go unseen. So I think we're getting super close right now. Well, do you know the exact position of the prison? Yeah, I know, I know. Wait, where are we? Okay, I do see Honey. Shark, don't say anything, okay? We're gonna give you a lot of diamonds. Of course, we already got spotted, but nothing some bribing with an unrealistic amount of diamonds couldn't handle. We'll give you two stacks of diamonds. Just don't say anything, okay? Deal? All we're doing is taking honey. Will you help us? We're not gonna harm anyone. Except you if you snitch. Okay, guys, follow me. I think it's exactly in this direction. In fact, it was a good thing Shark found us. We dug to the princess and could hear she was surrounded by Magic Kingdom members. Shark's no longer a leader because he kind of just there. Because I couldn't unshift at risk of being spotted, I signaled over to Shark to follow me out of ear's distance to ask him to go and distract the players surrounding the princess. Shark, I need you to go up and distract them. Bring them away from the jail. Alright, alright. Come on, guys, follow me, follow me. I got stuff for you guys, I got stuff for you guys. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh! <laughs> honey, honey, run. Wait, shift, everyone shift, everyone shift. Okay, I'm shifting. We did it! We dug her out, but we didn't have much time. We had to get as far away as possible before the other players realized she was gone. Guys, I think they might know. It's okay, it's okay, as long as they don't know where we leave. Everyone shift and do not unshift. This time, I made sure no one unshifted. I wasn't going to make that mistake again. World's slowest escape, let's go. <laughs> My fingers started to cram. We better not. I'm sure. Let's go, guys. Let's go. We're so close. Let's go. Oh, follow us. Follow us. Follow us. We'll, we'll bring you to the cathedral. Oh, Ace is right there. Ace. Ace. Follow us. Follow us. We got honey. We got honey. We saved honey. It looks so different from when I left. All right. Follow us inside this cathedral. Okay, I'm coming. All right, honey. Come up here. We did it, guys. Our princess is saved. Yeah. Honey, I just want to issue an apology. I'm sort of the reason that you were in this position in the first place, and I just want you to know I'm very sorry. And I I told you we'd come back for you. Yeah, we did. And you did. Yeah. yeah. All right, everyone. Three hurrahs for the queen. Hurrah, hurrah, hurrah. And now that we got the princess back, I could sense a great war was coming. It was crucial everyone was geared up and ready for battle. We began working on a secret XP farm below our base, and we kept it secret because we didn't want any of the enemy kingdoms finding it, using it for their gain, or destroying it. At this point, the nether had opened up to all the kingdoms, meaning players would now have the ability to go stronger than ever before. Think Waffles oh, and Ace managed to find us blaze spawners, which we used to upgrade our XP farm. After a couple of days of grinding, I managed to Chan, all of my armor and weapons, and then the Golden King approached me with a message from Chirito, the Joker. Josh, Chirito Burrito just delivered this note for you. Oh, what is it? 
I know you helped the princess escape. That's fine with me. Just know the fun has begun. Chirito blocked the Joker. Oh no, he knows, guys. How did he know it was us? Everyone, gear up, secure the towers. We're gonna be attacked soon. War is coming. War is coming. Oh, he knew. Th this wasn't good. I immediately called for an emergency meeting at the Order cathedral. The we have an emergency meeting. The magic tribe just gave me this book and quill. I'll read it to you. I know thee helped the princess escape. That's fine with me. Just know the fun has just begun. Chorito block. The Joker. That means war is coming. War is coming. Listen, guys. I've learned from our mistakes last time. A wise leader doesn't seek war, but rather prepares and waits for the battle to arrive at his doorstep. You know what that means, yes. boy? Secure the base and keep watch. Golden King, I want you on the tower team, keeping watch and looking out. Let us know yes. if anyone's coming. Ace, I want you to make sure everyone's geared up and prepared for war, okay? Weapons, armor. Move out, move out, move out. Let's go, 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 go. War is coming, brethren. Be prepared. Be wise. We continued to gear up as we waited for war to arrive at our doorstep. But surprisingly, it wasn't Chirito who first attacked. Yeah, put a bunch of that. We're being attacked, we're being attacked on top of the tower. Oh. He's on top of the tower. Oh no. Oh, he fell. Oh, well, Omeo luckily died after trying to escape with an ender pearl. But Lithrian was still on the run. Player Pugs then approached us saying this. I know our base cords, and I can tell you what they are. You know their base cords? Yeah, I'm a part of their tribe, and I'm willing to spy on them for you. Okay, we'll take that. Take us to their base. Okay. You better not be leading us into a trap. No, no, no I would never. You know, that Should sounds be... exactly like something that somebody... <laughs> Who was leading us into the trap? I was thinking the same thing, but you know what? We gotta do it. <laughs> Unsure if we could trust him, we decided to follow him anyways, since it was our only lead. So the castle that you see is like the above ground part, but we have our base underground. Look for name tags. See if you see anyone there. We probably have a lot of people here. I don't see any name tags though. We uh, dug underground to where you can you can't see the name tags. Just gotta go down here. Now I don't think you guys would trust me with the uh the free fall. Yeah, they're here, they're here. Name oh, tags. they're here. Shift, shift. There's One, like two, five three, people four, down five. here, yeah. Yeah, five. I don't think we should attack them yet we'll just take the cords and we'll come back later okay i'll talk to them and uh i'll try to make sure they don't think i'm uh spawning yeah 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 you do that now that we knew where their base was i decided to hold off on attacking so we could tell the others and come back more prepared for battle as we headed back to our base of course we find omil just moments after he looted his grave from earlier Oh, oh, hello. don't move. Whoa, whoa. Don't whoa, move. Whoa. Why hey. did you attack us? Uh, I didn't. I was trying to get Pug's loot back. Oh. Nah, that's a lie. You shot at me. That is not true. Did you, no, it is true. Did you no, say you should don't, don't. Whoa, oh, whoa, let me go in the water. Let me go in the water. Let me go in the water. Oh, hold on. Omeo, you shot at me first. You weren't trying to get his stuff back. Yeah, I wanted to capture you so you could tell me. Bro, that's what? such a lie. We've already <laughs> talked to Pug and he, he already. No, 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 no. Give us all your diamond stuff right now. Yeah. We'll let you go. Whoa. We'll let you go. I call executing him. Again. Or else we'll just kill you and take everything. I can make that arranged. No, Wait, I that's allowed? Yeah, yeah, like this. Don't. Oh my. <laughs> like this. Gold. Shoots him in face. Hey, at least we got his stuff still, so. Since Omeo good. wanted his items so bad, I decided to leave them right in the open where he could, you know, take them anytime he wants. What do you want? What do you want? I want my diamond armor back. Oh, you think you could come attack us and ask for your diamond armor back, bro? What kind of strategy is that? <laughs> A very good strategy. You literally come here, kill Gold's dog, try to kill me, Whoa. and you have the nerve to ask for your armor back, bro. I'm holding back <laughs> not to swing on you right now. By the way, if you want your armor, it's it's on top of that tower. You're a grave. No, you you can't go for it right now. Why can't I? Because I'm gonna shoot you. It's stupid. It's a stupid plan. Oh. While all of this was happening, Ace managed to kill just Jolty somehow. Jolty Bell was slain by Ace. Yes! Ace finally got revenge. Finally, we had gotten revenge on just Jolty. But this wouldn't be the end of his reign of terror. In fact, it would only make him even more mad. We gathered a group of soldiers and headed to the new mountain kingdom it that is. we had discovered earlier. Rumor has it this is where Omeo and just Jolty lived. We're going down here to raid this. Wait, 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 did you kill them? Yeah, uh, just Jolly has my stuff. Just Jolly has my stuff. Yeah, just Jolly is the ones who killed us. Yeah, these are the guys. These are the guys. Kill them. Let me get his grave. Let me get his grave. 
Move! Move, move! Of course! I lag and Jolte comes out of nowhere and kills me and once again flees into the shadows. I was mad. I was upset. And he freaking got me. He came out of nowhere, shifting like a dirtbag. I headed back to get my items and we raided their base. But then I get an alert of an intruder back at our base. And I arrive just in time to catch him raiding our old chest tower. What are you doing? Nice, Pumba. Nice. Was that the intruder? Yeah, yeah, no, this is the intruder. Okay, because he just stole all of her stuff. I thought so. Oh. Ah, what the frick? Yes! Oh, yes, because I hit him too. Nice. Did you get his grave? That was kind of easy. Oh, Zolti came out of nowhere. Ah, but finally, frick? his greedy thirst for our blood had cost him. We had all of his items. His That's reign of terror was finally put to an end. So he had a swift obsidian blade, sharpness four, knockback two. Um, 10.5 attack damage. Mystic, what do you have in that bag? Here, just look at it. Oh my gosh, <laughs> what? 49 blocks of emeralds and five stacks of emeralds. Whoa, okay, whoa, 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 whoa. What, what was the... this man doing? That's like okay, we were shocked at how much emeralds Jolty had. We had suspicions either he was duping, hacking, or perhaps was just really skilled, which, I mean, maybe. Either way, we were now in possession of all of his items. And so I began to spread the riches around our kingdom as a flex of our victory. I even made an honorable statue to celebrate. There we go, guys. Now we will be victorious. Is that a rocket ship? Yeah, there we go. Let me do it for you. It was now time to find the stronghold and defeat the dragon. Having access to the end would come in handy, as ender pearls would be really useful. So we divided into two groups, one to stay and protect our base, and the other to follow me in search of the stronghold. Oh, guys, it's cold. Whoa, look at this northern light. During our travels, we stumbled upon this wow, beautiful snow so biome beautiful. where we could see the northern lights. And for a moment, there was a break in all the chaos of war. The beauty of the lights forced me into the present moment and all I could sense was a gratitude to have the opportunity to witness such a surreal moment. It was magical. Jeez, look at those lights, eh, boys? Oh, shoot, wait, I do see it. So beautiful. But just like all moments, no. this Everyone one straight down. too fled. We found the stronghold and prepared for battle. Terry, my DoorDash wow, driver, what are you doing down here, buddy? All right, brethren, I've gathered you here because you guys are noble members of the Forest Tribe. I appreciate all of you for working with us and growing as a tribe together as we enter this ender dragon battle i wish each and every one of you the best luck remember stay together and don't die we're gonna need you guys for this next fight against the plains tribe all right brethren here we go hurrah all right boys go 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 we began shooting the towers but just as i pulled my bow back the dragon knocks me off the tower oh my gosh oh my gosh Oh, half a heart! Half a heart! That was so close. I thought that was gonna be it. After destroying all the towers, we okay, launched fiery arrows in. into the sky until finally oh the dragon was no more. Yes! Let's go! Let's go! It's dead! Oh, Woo! Let's go! We collected the XP and slayed a bunch of endermen for ender pearls, grabbed the dragon egg, and hopped back into the overworld, where I placed the egg on top of the castle's flag as a trophy of our victory. Boom. While all of this was happening, though, apparently all the kingdoms decided to combine it to one large kingdom, which was smart because that means they had the highest chance of winning this challenge. I then called the members of the forest kingdom in the cathedral for one last speech. All right, guys, this battle is going to determine whether or not we've been victorious in this challenge or not. Stick close. This is going to be the hardest one we've faced yet. Follow me. Hurrah, hurrah, attack! We began our approach for the final battle. This was it. There would only be one victorious attack. kingdom. Perlin, 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 into the trees. Ah! Oh my gosh, that was so close. Okay, okay, stay alive. Why am I so bad with Ender Pearls? Let's go. Oh my god. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Aim, aim. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Got him. Attack, boys. You good? 
Yeah. Oh god. Oh, dragon, god. dragon's above you. Dragon? Dragon, you good? Oh, he's gone. I, th I think I saw John. Where is he? He's on. He's over there. Hey, who's shooting? Hey, Go, Pumbaa, get him! They're in the trees! Above us! Light them on fire! The trees. Let's go, arrow, boys! Arrow the last here. couple are up here! They're up here! Got him! I got him! You got your eco? The one that shot me. Nice. Oh, this is the other combat log. Yeah, combat logger. How did you combat? Oh, oh this is your combat <laughs> log. Excalibur, bro. Above us. We were doing great, but there were still players on top of the trees, which was not good because they had the high ground. Who's up there? Oh, God. Ah, 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 <laughs> Light the whole base on fire! We set Everything their base on fire, fire, then I began chasing the final player, Mikuo. The last one. Oh no! He got me! What? You have the Excalibur, that's why. GG's. For this challenge, I'm gonna let you, the viewer, decide who won. Comment below who you think the best kingdom and player was, and subscribe and leave a like on the video. Subscribe! <laughs> well, Josh, looks like you beat me this time. But next time, oh, oh next time, my friend, I will be victorious. <laughs>